Ladies, well, you all enjoyed that. You're Olympic finalists. Oh, we did it! <laughs> we keep being like, oh my God, we're in the final. Oh, it's an amazing feeling. We said we were going to do it. We did it. I'm so proud of us. It's amazing. And you kicked it all off. What do you think you ran for your first leg? I know what I ran. 50, 90. <laughs> delighted with that like it felt like a really good run uh, I didn't think it was that fast but uh, yeah it's what I'm so happy I could start it off well so absolutely yeah. like starting it off well is so important Phil you took it over and again you remained you, you kept that lead going fantastic yeah even at 300 I knew where Sophie was and she is miles ahead of everybody else so I knew I had to use that 200 meter speed I said I ran a 200 pb at the first half but uh, it's so important to be in such a good position at 200 obviously because it means the line up for leg three then when I pass it over to Kelly so yeah I just tried to hold it off. I knew Liga Claver would be coming fast behind me, but oh my God, it's like, it's an Olympic final. It's so, uh, so, so special to be part of this team. It's Kelly's first Olympics. Um, no, it's just, it's just so, so special. And to be in that Olympic final, like, it's what dreams are made of. And just to do it with the girls, like, oh, it's just unreal. First Olympics and Olympic final, it's not too bad, is it? Yeah, it's not too bad. <laughs> not a bad sport work. Um, yeah, like Phil, I went out hard to 200. You know, we had like another team changing over at the same time. I knew I'd have to go out hard and I wanted to stay in front of the pack at the start rather than behind and trying to fight for spots. So I just went out hard, tried to be at the front of the pack at 200 to make sure Charlene got good position again at the lineup. And then I definitely paid for it in the second half. But I knew when I was passing over to Charlene that uh, we were in good hands. So but It was a brave move when you got the button because you had to put yourself in the race and you went for it. Yeah, yeah, I knew like it was going to take a brave run to get out in front and not to get caught up in, you know, any mess. And then if you want to, you know, execute the race, you just have to be brave at the start. So I knew I had to do that. Um, and yeah, I'm just, I can't believe we're saying it. We're in the final. Puzzles. Charlene, again, like so mature, so experienced, but patient on that last leg. Unbelievable. You knew what you had to do, but yet you were so composed. Yeah, I was like, just use the girls in front of me. Uh, I do get impatient. I probably look super controlled, but I always want to make that brave move. But I have so much trust in my last 100 in a relay. <laughs> It was just like top three, that's all we had to do. And I got the band in fourth and so close together. So yeah, we're going into the final with an auto queue. We are absolutely buzzing. And another really fast leg of 49.6. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty pleased with that. I was disappointed with my mixed run, but I was out there on my own and I find it so hard to judge. But when there's people in front of me, I don't even think about being in the race. So yeah, it was just moving out wide on that last 100 and <laughs> we're in an Olympic final. I can't I believe it. <laughs> and Kelly, what about the atmosphere in here? Oh my God, it's unbelievable. When I came out first, when we were walking through the tunnel, I could just hear the noise. And you're inside and it's so quiet. You can hear everyone breathing. You can nearly hear your heart beating. It's so quiet. And then to come out here, it is just phenomenal. And Phil, waiting around to get the Olympic Games going yourself, you know, you must be so excited just to get things rolling this morning. Absolutely. It's been a, it's been a long way to warm up with the, the girls and the lads the other day for the mixed relay. And it was such a special thing to be part of that too but to come out here today Rashida was so right it feels like we are in Morton Stadium the crowd like a special mention to all the Irish travellers coming over to support us um, and the support back home is just absolutely unbelievable this is the closest we'll get to home games and it really does feel like we are at home and Sophie a busy week for yourself but you're going to go out on a high it's an Olympic final tomorrow night absolutely like we're Olympic finalists I can't believe it like I heard Rihanna playing I think it was like disturbing or something when we were waiting behind the blocks I was like this is going to go well so <laughs> requesting Rihanna again tomorrow but yeah it's, we're on a high like it's amazing brilliant well done thank you thank you